Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel, Jazzland. We're gonna do a let's learn because now that Princess Island, we've done the open house, it's time to pack it up. And a lot of people will ask me, you know, how do you pack your things up so and store them in your inventory? Because I don't want to have to do this all over again from scratch, right? So I figure out what I'll do is I will show you guys how I pack up my builds and soft link it and bring it into my inventory in sections. Um, and I'll do a little bit of it um, just normal speed. But after I show you the basic steps to what I do, then I will do the rest of the video on a speed edit um, because you'll get the idea. And then y'all can see how I'm going to pack up this build so that I can res it out at another time if I feel like it. But yeah, so I'll teach you how to do that or teach you how I do it anyway. I'm sure there's many ways, but we'll get that done and then it'll be time to move again. <laughs> Cause y'all know me. All right, so let's get into it. All right, so let's start packing up. We'll pack up some more. Um, I've already packed up this little entryway in this part out here. So let's come in here. See if I can get around the door. Let's come in here and work on this living room. Let's work on the living room. Um, so in my inventory, under my builds, I made a folder for the Fair Chang Aquarium House build. And then I'm soft linking things and pulling them as a group into a folder, which tells me where in the house that cluster of things is supposed to go. So I did the entryway outside, which is everything. I had a fountain here, a little mailbox, some plants, flip flop sand, welcome mat. Um, I had a plant thing over here. I had the little table here with the plant. So all of that is in this folder. But if you notice, I didn't rename anything. Like I didn't add an extra prim to it and try to rename it. Um, Cause I didn't feel like it. <laughs> That's why I'm naming the folders. And then the upper back patio outside office door. That was up here. Hang on. This is where, this was the patio. So this is the upper patio. I took everything off here, soft linked it and threw it in that folder. So that's basically how I'm gonna do this one um, when I'm packing it up. So let's make a folder called living room, new folder. And this is gonna be all the living room decor in here. Nail. Get that out of the way. The things that are no copy, um, this, this is copy with a resizer in it. So the script makes it where I can't like actually link it to this. So that's okay to pull back in the inventory. This TV is not copyable. So this is the thing that I want to make sure I take back into my inventory. Because it is definitely no copy and we are not going to lose this thing. So I'm going to right click. I'm going to take it into inventory. Now, I don't know where it put it. So I'm going to open a second inventory window and go under recent. Oh, it doesn't say anything. Let's see, television. Television? Maybe I put it under TV. Uh -uh. I don't even remember the name. I should have looked at it when I had it in uh, edit mode. Not in the trash. Not in the trash. Y'all, where's my TV? Uh-oh. I don't even know what it's called. 
Where is it? Where is it? Oh. Oh, there it is. The VEA, blah, 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 blah. Okay, there's my TV. No copy. So it is safely put away. Phew. I was about to have a moment. I'm not going to put that in living room because I have to use that TV anywhere I go. So we're not going to add it into this decor. All right. So let's start over here. I think I linked that entire thing. Yes, I did. Control Z. So we've got that. I'm going to hold the shift key. And I'm going to select all these other pieces that are here one at a time by holding shift and clicking on them. I don't know how many of these I can do at once. That whole thing I had already linked together. So we are going to see how much of this I can pull into my inventory at one time. Mm -hmm. Because all the rest of this stuff is copyable. And that way, I have, let me pull that up. I have, click on that, click on the rug. I think there is a limit as to how many items you can pull in and soft link at a time, but we're about to find out. Let's see if I can do all of this. Whoops. It's hard to see if I have that selected or not. Okay, is the rug highlighted? Yeah, I can barely see the blue line. All right, so that's selected. Let's come over here. Grab this, grab that, grab the table. And I think I linked all of that together. The cookies, the <laughs> Oreo extender, as I call it, and the milk is new. So I'm not gonna pull that. I'm gonna pull that in. Well, no. Yeah, I'm going to pull that in separate because I don't want to have to res this entire thing out just to get those back out if I want them. All right, so inventory. Let me open another window and go to recent. So that's all the living room over here except for what's back here, right? Okay, so let me grab all of this and try to take it. So we're going to right click and we're going to take it. Oh, shoot, y'all, look. Ooh. Mm. Do I want to try and get that back out? See, it has the name of the last thing that I took. Okay, I'm not going to res that back out and try to restore it. That was too much. So I'm going to take this grouping that I just did, and I'm going to drag it over to the living room folder. And then we're going to edit. And I'm going to grab, I forgot this thing was a sectional. So we're going to grab these three items. Let me make sure I got it all. Nope, I don't have it all. Control Z. And we'll grab that. Now do I have it all? Yes. And then I'm going to take this in inventory. And it should show up under recent. Would you show up under recent for me? Ugh. SL is not doing things I want it to do. Oh, it went back in here. Alright, it went back in the original. That's why. That's the one thing about taking stuff back in inventory. Is it will put it back in the original folder that it came from. So originally the Taylor modular sofa was in here, but since I'm in the recent tab, it's only gonna show me what I just picked up. So let me take this and drag it over to living room because that's part of the living room. And then I'm gonna grab this as a little group. Edit, I'm gonna grab the fork and I wanna grab that. You know what, I am gonna rename this because I wanna find this later. So this is what we'll do. We will take and res a friend. 
I like the circles. <laughs> I don't know why. I like it better than a box. So we're going to res that. And then I'm going to rename this object to milk cookies and extender because then I'll know what it is for me. All right, so let's go back. We need to select this prim last. So here, shift key, the fork, the glass of milk, and that. And then we are going to take that in inventory. And that went into objects, milk cookies and extender. All right. And we're gonna put this in the living room folder. And then that way, when I search my inventory and I type in extender, there it is right there and I can find it and res it out in any house. Ta-da! All right, back to what we were doing. Mm -mm -mm. So that took all that stuff. All right, let's come over here. We're gonna take all this section, the two plants and then all this stuff and put it in the living room folder. So select that, hold the shift key, I want that. All of the, oh, I linked all of that. Did I link it all? It looks like I did. Okay, shift and select that. Shift and select that. I'm going to move it and make sure I have it all. Yes, I do. Oops, just kidding. And then we're going to right click and we're going to take it. And then I'm going to look at my recent, there it is, Mithril Wall Bar Plant, because that's the last thing I picked up. And we're going to take this and we're going to drag it to the living room folder. So right now, these four groupings, that's everything that was in my living room. And when I get ready to res it back out, that's all I have to do. Res it back out and it'll be there. Pretty nifty, eh? Let's do this, y'all, this kitchen. I'm wondering about this kitchen. There's a lot of stuff in here. There's a whole lot of stuff in here. All right, what are we? We're at 11 minutes. Okay. Actually, let's do a smaller area. I'll do the kitchen on the speed edit because it's gonna take a minute. Let's go out here. How about we do this back garden area? All right, so let's make another folder. This is gonna be, we'll call this um, outside back garden patio area. So we're gonna take everything that's back here and we're gonna put it, bring it in. All right, let's start. Right now I have the house highlighted, but it's still locked. Okay, so actually I'm gonna start here with that. And then we will select each and every one of these little things without selecting the house. That. Raise it. SL is being so temperamental lately. I don't get it. Now, the reason why I'm not actually linking these items for real is because anything with animations in it will end up being broken and I don't want to break anything. So soft linking just means I'm selecting them all in a big group and taking it into my inventory as a big group. Some of this stuff is so cute, y'all. That. All right, that's all of that. Let's do this right here. Oh, I need to get the sand. Actually, yeah, we'll get the sand too. Because that's part of it. And then let's do this swing. We'll see if it'll let me take all of this into inventory as a group. Uh, the shower. Okay, that towel rack is linked to everything on the wall. So I'm not gonna take the shower, we'll take that as a whole. 
All right. The wisteria. Is the wisteria linked to something? Let's find out. Okay, the wisteria and all those plants are linked to outdoor. Okay. So I think this is it. And if it'll let me take all of it at once, let's move it first and make sure I have what I want. Did I grab everything? It looks like I did. Okay. Yeah, I grabbed everything. So let's right click and take. Take. Boom. The only thing about that is you don't want to let it go. Like click on a single item because then you have to start over. And there it is in my object. So this needs to be drug over into outside back garden patio area. And there it is. So I can just res that out as a group and move it. All right, what else we got? What else we got? I'll do that in a minute. All right. So, well, I'll show you this too. What I did with the outside, I linked a lot of this stuff. Like if I click on this ivy, do you see it's that ivy on the ground? This ivy, the ivy on the walls. The reason I didn't link this is because it's animated and it would have broken the animations if I linked it um, with all of this. So it's all that stuff on the outside. It's the wisteria, it's the ivy. It's the ivy on this wall and it should be the stuff out front, yeah. And it's the stuff out front, see? The ivy here and ivy there. All of that is one piece. So, linked, it's actually linked as a piece. So what we're gonna do is make a folder for this and then we'll soft link the shower. So let's make a folder. We'll call this um, outdoor shower plus wall ground ivy cover. Will it let me put that slash in there? It sure will. All right, as you can see, it's still selected. I'm gonna hit the shift key, select the shower. So now I should have all of that. So let's see what I got going on. This darn monkey tree. The monkey pie tree, yeah. See, I've got all of that. So we're gonna take this in the inventory. Right click and take. Bam, there it all went. Y'all, it takes a long time to put this stuff together, but you see how quickly it disappears. Ha <laughs> ha! But at least I'm not deleting it. At least I'm not deleting it. All right. So where did that go? Oh, is it in bathroom? Okay. Since this is recent, again, it's only showing me the things I've been messing with since I started this. If I had looked this folder up in inventory, it would have tons more stuff in it. So I know this is the grouping that I just did. So I'm gonna drag this over to my outdoor shower plus wall ground ivy color, cover, color. <laughs> and there it is, right? There it is. Okay. So there's that. But anyway, so you get the idea, right? Oh, how about we close build tools, Jess? Okay, so you get the idea of how I make the folder um, shift and select all the items in the grouping, find it in recent, and then move it over to the actual folder. That's how I'm gonna keep track of everything for this build. So I think that's enough to show y'all as far as how I actually do it. The rest of this is gonna be a speed edit. So I'm gonna fly through the rest of it, speed it up, because y'all don't need to hear me talk and do that with every little thing right <laughs> and we'll just edit these videos together <laughs> to make them look like we got through it quickly all right let's do speed editing shall we yes yes we shall
Shaking but not stirred. Just a lesson that I've learned. And so it goes. Tables turn.
become a sunny day A day when I forget Seem to focus when you're getting close to me. We're like a broken record spinning round and round again. I know that I can do more. I know that you feel the same. Why we keep on playing all of these games? I don't wanna go, cause your love is what I want, babe. You know that I wanna stay this way forever. I wanna stay.
went down between you and me and i'm feeling pretty good right now so i think i'm gonna let that go all the dreams that we had i remember what you said uh, just the one time thing it won't happen no more did it not say you did the wrong thing uh, did it for the wrong reasons kept on going wrong direction uh, went in too deep at first take what you need trying to guess what happens after this Does it? 
That Princess Island is no more. <laughs> so now it is ready to almost ready 
to be given up. Um, I still have my platform up there and I still have my gamer girl loft up there, which is really easy. Um, because the gamer girl loft is on a res box, so I can delete that whole thing real fast and then just res it out anywhere I want it. Um, but anyway, that is how I pack up a build. So hopefully that was interesting to you, but now you know how I do it. And if you like this video, <laughs> make sure you give it a thumbs up, um, uh, because it helps my videos be seen on YouTube and... Um, please subscribe if you have not subscribed already and hit the notification bell so you know when I put out a new video or go live next time to do whatever it is I'm doing. So yeah, it's done. It's all here in my inventory. The entire build is in my Fair Chain Aquarium House build folder, including the edited house. So I did not lose all the work. It's all here. And I can res that back out at any time and set the whole thing right back up depending on what land I have, right? But now it's time to downsize. I'm gonna be downsizing again and moving again. I still have a stilt linden home of my own that I need to um, decorate. So I need to do that as well while I'm looking. Gosh, y'all, my throat's dry. You'd think it wouldn't be since I haven't been talking. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you guys on the next uh, video or live stream or whatever it is. All right, see you soon.